Um, run first. Yeah, I think I have enough time. Let's just get out of here. Oh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go over to the the hiding spot if I can make it. <laughs> See if he can find you around the curtain again. Okay, he can't follow me back here. I'm just gonna wait for him to disappear. That's so weird. <laughs> In this case, it's 250 pounds. It's 250 pounds. Okay, is, his way through. Yeah, it is not helping at all. And he's sn- smelling me. Like a bloodhound? No, I think he just needs some tissues. More like a pig or something. He must have a cold. Yes, let's shake the sand out of your shoes. Stock him up with some Ricola and some Kleenexes, and he's good to go. I'll just drop that hammer and go plant some flowers somewhere. (laughs) Why flowers? I don't know. Because that's what's on the Ricola. Okay, he's gone. I am going to go get holy water now, because we need it. Can you get out? No. I'm gonna try. Is it like hardcore lock to where the master key won't even open it? <laughs> I mean, you know how some of those games have like the. Oh, look, the master key can open it. Oh, okay. I mean, but you know how some of those games have like the secret, secret thing where you can only open it unless you've completed the stage? That I don't know. But I, I get what you're saying. <laughs> kind of like Spoonie's review of Final Fantasy. You have a dragon, yet... Okay, never mind. I, I know, like... <laughs> <laughs> you just have to watch. It's really funny. Some people know know what they must. They must have seen his Final Fantasy VIII review. It is genius. It's awesome. Oh, now he's back again. But where is he? Right there. <laughs> I'm going to go with right there. Yes. And swinging his hammer is enough to send the panic meter up. That sucks. Now he, did. he doesn't have a master key. Ha ha. Ha ha. Well, he ha. can probably still come through the door. Or this door. Ha. Nope, he's, he's at the entrance. Crap. Well, it took him a while to find the master key. Just say that. Well, because we unlocked the door and he got in. Uh, do the same trick again. Wait for him to, to disappear. Yay! Oh, sacred curtain of wonder. The sacred curtain of invincibility and... Where no hammers can pass. Sacred curtain of protection, we bow down before thee. It's a great rock band song. <laughs> I don't know about that. Downloadable content, Clock Tower 3 soundtrack. <laughs> nice. Okay, now we know where we need to go. We have to go back up to that, above the stage area. Now available on the Beaver 6D Fever. Ding. Oh, please spare me. <laughs> I love that commercial. Apparently, Bieber, if this was Be- Justin Bieber, he'd be dead already. I don't know. Uh, yeah, you're right. His hair would scare the guy away. Exactly. He would swoosh it, and the guy would just instantly fall in love with him. And he'd be like, ooh. Justin Bieber. The big guy with the hammer has Bieber fever. 6G fever? 6G. <laughs> What's a 6G? What's a Bieber? <laughs> I don't know. Kind of looks like a girl. <laughs> Okay, uh, what? Oh, this is going to be precarious. Oh, goodness. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh. oh, oh Just okay. like the noises we make when we're on the toilet. Mm-hmm. Now, this would totally, this would totally have broken. Yeah, she would have fallen uh, by now. Probably. I'm going to go with you. It probably would have broken. I mean. What's this? Well, pliers? Pliers, pliers, pliers. Pliers? Really? We walked all the way across this flimsy looking rotted board for a player pliers. Okay, I'm gonna go into detail, people. I'm sorry about that. Uh, we had to edit 
edit that out, we actually did fall off the plank. Um, we were able to get the pirates to make our way back across, and now we're being attacked by the big guy again. Yeah. And there's a butterfly. There's a butterfly. I was hoping it would protect us, but apparently it's a good for nothing butterfly. The butterflies actually will call the bad guy toward us. Oh, that's gay. Throw some freaking holy water on it. The, I don't. We can. I think maybe it would work, but I don't want to waste it. I think you just need to find a giant flash water and spot it. True. That would be much easier than holy water. Alyssa. I have a thing for 15 year olds and butterflies and dresses. Throw some water on it. If it follows you out the store, you better be throwing water on it. But we're getting out of here. I'm pretty sure I have to take the pliers to back to the tailor. Oh god. Alyssa. 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 <laughs> that was funny, I'm sorry. <laughs> Go away. Go to a pharmacy and buy cough medicine. We're sorry they'll probably only let you have one bottle, but you'll just have to deal with it. It's just some Oh, are you serious? Don't touch me, don't touch me. It's just some fixed vapor rubber. Whatever that is that you squirt on the back of your throat. I'm sorry, but this guy is way too slow to have caught up with it. Caught up with it by now. Well, I don't, I'm glad he is slow. Uh. Oh, great, this is the door. Pliers! Use the pliers, yes. You clipped four times and made it look like that? I'm impressed. I got like some speed plier skills going on. It's and well, he can't come in here good. All right, let's look around. What's this on the chair? We have a card. Re repellent arrow. Ooh, it's green. I like it. It's green. It's my favorite color. It's environmentally friendly. <laughs> and what's this on the mantle? Ooh. A carved wooden box. Open it. Yes, why not? Oh, we love ransacking houses. Oh, a flashback. Love flashbacks. Oh, it's Daddy. Is he the guy that lost his arm? He, well, he's Daddy, yes. <laughs> I have to tell you something important. Daddy's going off to war. Ooh, war. War? I hate the thought of leaving you here all alone. What is I that? <laughs> what is war? I'll be alright. But what about you? You'll miss me and be sad when you're in war. <laughs> I'm more concerned about not getting my head shot off. And all those Precious bullets flying around? Wolf. Won't you be worried? Don't worry. Daddy, don't forget the piano concourse is on Christmas Eve. The winner will have their performance aired on the radio. I'll practice really hard and win the contest so that you can hear me when you're out in the war. Oh, that would be wonderful. The competition will be stiff, but if you go to your lessons and practice properly, I'm sure you can do it. Okay, so she has to... She basically has to play the piano correctly and not mess up and play. will succeed. And she's kind of funny to think that every man out there has their own radio. Before you got married, remember? I'll play this tune on Christmas Eve so you can think of Mummy and me. Then it'll be like we're all together again. 